LeVar Ball has been called a lot of things, crazy, delusional, bold, arrogant, entertaining. But there's one description of Ball I'm not so sure he deserves, which is related to these $60 Big Baller brand t-shirts he's now selling alongside those ridiculously overpriced Big Baller brand shoes. But let's just keep it to the t-shirt, which reads, stay in your lane. That's what Ball told Fox Sports co-host Christine Leahy to do after she asked him point blank how many pairs of Big Baller brand shoes he'd sold. It's a legit question to a man who's peddling $495 gym shoes and fashions himself as a mogul in the making. People are labeling Ball a sexist because of the tense back and forth between him and Leahy, and now that he's turned this into a marketing opportunity, for some, it's made LeVar Ball that much more unlikable, if that's even possible. There's a lot of things I love to call LeVar Ball. Good for business, a pain in the ass, but I didn't consider his reaction sexist. It was rude, it was childish, but I watched him loudly argue with Stephen A. Smith for 20 minutes that he was better than Michael Jordan. Stay in your lane is gender neutral. It's not the same as telling a woman to go to the kitchen and make you a sandwich. I believe he would have told a man to stay in his lane too, especially if that person previously said his own children are afraid of him as Leahy did. Which only makes this more ironic since LeBron told LeVar Ball to stay in his lane after he ignorantly waxed poetic about LeBron's kids. A man arguing with a woman the way LeVar Ball did just rubs people the wrong way. <laughs> and I'm not sure that's fair to LeVar Ball or to women like Leahy who don't need help holding their own. I relate to this because I live it on this show every day. If I yell at Mike and rag on him, it's entertainment. If he does it to me, people think he's being rude or an Well, more than usual.